Okay, Brian, bit of shush, thanks. Settle down. Come on. Bah! Thank you. Day 29, how are we all feeling? Everyone have fun at karaoke last night? Okay, right here. Now, as your cruise director, it's my job to make sure that your trip on the Oasi Express is a genuine once-in-a-lifetime experience. And I know a lot of you are dying to get to the Middle East, but I have noticed just a little bit of negativity creeping in ever since we set hoof on this boat. And I want to take a moment to address some of those comments now. Not enough space. It's too hot. I don't like standing in my own excrement. Guys, it's got to stop. You're making Barnaby Joyce upset. And he is an expert in standing in his own excrement. Derek, cover your mouth when you cough, thanks. <coughs> Cheers. Now, you lot of whingers want to know what is worse than standing in your own waste? Hmm? Jeopardising a $250 million industry. That's what. Because that is exactly what you guys are doing every time one of you buckles at the knees and collapses from dehydration. Now, the farmers back home are relying on you to tough this out. OK? So think of the farmers before your knees buckle, please. They're literally dying. And that brings me to my next point. Dying. Please, could we just all ease up on the dying? OK, there'll be plenty of time to die when we get to the Middle East. But right here, on board, it's killing the vibe. I've lost count of how many of you have been dying. I mean, to be fair, every time I start counting, I fall asleep. But then, when I wake up, more of you have died. And it's making the papers back home, and it's not a good look! I don't want to be that guy. I'm the fun sheep. I'm the party sheep. I'm the sheep that keeps the good times rolling. But I'm also the sheep whose job it is to deliver you safely before handing you over to a supply chain where it's virtually impossible to monitor the manner in which you will be ritually slaughtered. OK, but you can't be slaughtered if you're already dead. So all I'm asking from you lot is to have a bit of respect for the basic slaughtering process. Is that too much to ask? Could someone help Derek back on his feet, please? <clears throat> Thank you. Now, just finally, I do want to address the very serious issue of animal cruelty. Most of you will be familiar with the sheepdog Wilbur. Now, sadly, his velvet cushion went missing from the captain's cabin recently, and he's had to endure several nights sleeping on the hardwood floor. It's just degrading. Imagine if people back home found out how we treated our pets on board. There'd be outrage. So if you see Wilbur, give him a pat. OK, that's it from me. Hope we're all looking forward to the Level 4 disco tonight. The fancy dress theme is zombie sheep. So see you there. Oh, looks like Derek's already wearing his costume. <laughs> oh, Derek's dead. Okay, selfish, see? Valet Derek, chuck him overboard. Everybody else, no die.